The word BODMAS can be used to help you decide which order you carry out operations in. The B stands for brackets, so anything in brackets you do first. Then you've got powers, so the O stands for powers. These are things like squares and cubes, so like 3 squared which is 9, 5 cubed 125. The D stands for division, the M stands for multiplication, A stands for addition and finally you've got S which is subtraction, so you do the subtraction bits last. Okay, so the more important things are at the top of the word bod mass, so you do these things first and you work your way downwards. So let's look at three examples. So in example one we need to work out 9 add 7 times 3. So do we do the 9 add 7 first or the 7 times 3? So let's look at our word bod mass. Well, as you can see, multiplication is above addition. So that means we do the multiplying part first of all. So we have to work out 7 times 3. So 7 times 3 is 21. So we end up with 9 add 21. And then finally, let's do the addition part. So 9 add 21 is 30. So let's move on to example 2. This time we need to work out 30 take away 6 divided by 2. So again let's use the word bod mass to decide which bit to do first. Do we do the 30 take away 6 or the 6 divided by 2? So again let's go to our word bod mass. Um, division comes above subtraction. So that means the division part is more important than the subtraction. So we do the division part first of all. So 6 divided by 2 is 3. So the next thing to work out is 30 take away 3, which is 27. So our final example then, we have 7 add 4 in a bracket multiplied by 9. So this time we have something inside the bracket. If you get brackets, you always do the bit inside the bracket first of all. So, brackets is at the top of the word bod mass, that's why you do it first. So, we just need to work out 7 add 4, which is 11. So, we end up with 11 times 9, and 11 times 9 is 99.